Hi, I'm Melissa Reid, Chief Sustainability Officer at Sustain Life. In this video, we're going to talk about how to calculate your emissions from the business travel and commuting of your employees. Now, business travel, including long distance and short distance trips, accounts for 20% of all travel in the United States. And business travel was in fact so high in pre-pandemic levels that it actually endangered our ability to meet climate goals required to keep global warming in check to 1.5 degrees. Now, even though business travel is one of the most carbon intensive activities a company can do, only a third of companies include business travel in their greenhouse gas reporting. And that has to change. And it's not just business travel. Daily commuting accounts for 30% of all travel in the United States. And reminder, transportation is the heaviest emitting sector in the country. And where does business travel and commuting fit in in a greenhouse gas inventory? These are considered scope three emissions because they're indirect emissions that are created by your employees, which of course are part of your value chain. So how do you calculate emissions from business travel? All you need to do is collect the miles that you've traveled on each mode of transit, like air, rail, car, bus. You can typically get this information from your office manager or third-party travel agent. Enter the information into a tool like Sustain Life for accurate emissions outputs. And what about commuting? A lot of organizations will want to do a commuting survey to understand the transportation habits of their workforce. This is something that's required if you're a company going for LEED certification. And how do you calculate your emissions from employee workforce commuting? The best way is to perform a commuting survey and understand what modes of transit your employees are taking on a daily basis. You can plug the results of that survey into a tool like Sustain Life for accurate emissions outputs. And if you don't have that data, you haven't done a commuting survey, you can provide some information and estimates around your workforce to get an estimate of what those emissions might look like. So whether you're compiling a robust greenhouse gas inventory or just looking for some directional inputs to understand what are your greatest emission sources and what you can do about them, come check us out at sustain.life.